if you don't like my opinion, it is what it is, man. You know, everybody has their opinions when it comes to this stuff. I think at the end of the day, some people are gonna love a certain jersey, some people are gonna hate it. There's gonna be mixed opinions on every single jersey that there is. So the first jersey that we got is Atlanta Phase. And honestly, it's not bad. You know, I, I, I like the clean look. I think I would just do more with the bar in the middle. Like, I don't really like the, the AF thing going on, I guess. I don't know if that's what's happening around there. So I'm gonna put it in like the B tier. I'm gonna put it in the B. Next one we got is Dallas Empire. Now this looks pretty clean, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I always like the Dallas colors. I think the colors look really well. They pop a lot. And I like that everything's centered. Um, so it definitely has like a clean look to it. But I'm gonna put it in the A tier. We'll put it in the A. Next we got Florida Mutineers. This one's probably Honestly, my favorite one. For for some reason, I just really like the design in the middle. I think they were really creative with what they were doing. I'm gonna put this one in the S tier, man. This is this is my favorite one for sure. Next, we got LA Gorillas. Now, this one, this one's interesting to me. They went with like a like a weird graffiti type vibe. I kind of I kind of like it just because it's different compared to some of the other teams and what they were trying to do. So I'm gonna put this one in the in the A tier. I think that one's pretty cool. What's up, Gizmo? What's up, bro? Next, we got Los Angeles Thieves. Um, I always love what 100 Thieves does with their merchandise and, and their apparel. Um, their jerseys weren't really cutting it for me. I know most teams, again, like I said before, are following a template, so I, I guess they were limited on what they had to do. I like that they were keeping a clean, simple look. Gizmo, come on. I'm trying to do a video here, buddy, come on. So we're gonna put it in the B tier. Um, it still looks cool, it still looks clean. I just think that they could have done more. Next, we got the London Royal Ravens. Um, this one's interesting to me. Sometimes I like it when I look at it and sometimes I don't. I don't know, I think I'm gonna put this one in the in the C tier. I'm not really messing with it. I don't know what it is. Next, we got the Minnesota Rocker. This looks pretty dope, I'm not gonna lie. I, I like it. I don't like how it changes between like so many light blues and dark blues and purples and blacks. There's a lot going on, but it does look really cool. So we'll put it in the... Hmm. We'll give it a B. We'll put it in the B tier. But I know some people really like this jersey. People like go crazy over this one. So I mean, it's all personal preference. But most of these jerseys are pretty cool. Just you know, this one I'm gonna put in the B tier. Next we got uh, the New York jersey. Obviously, I'm gonna be biased here and just put it at the top. So we'll just skip over that one. Just so you guys don't he need to hear my biased opinion. <laughs> then we got the Optic Gaming jersey. I actually really like this. Like that they kept it simple, but also gave it a little bit of pop and a little bit of flair. Um, I'm gonna put this one in the A tier. I wouldn't put it in the S tier, but we'll, we'll give it an A tier. Next we got Paris Legion. I mean Paris. What are you guys doing, man? I mean, you like, you slept your logo on the top and then you put a slab in the middle. Like I, I yeah, dude, I don't know, man. It, it, that one's going in the D tier, bro. Put it at the bottom. What's the lowest you can do? D tier? Throw it in the bottom, bro. And then we got Seattle Surge. Um, I think Surge did a great job with, uh, with everything. I think it looks clean. The colors look great. I like the balance. Um, I like the placement and everything. And I love what they did with the skyline in the middle with the bar. That's what I was saying before. I, I just want to see some creativity in the middle. Um, I think Seattle killed this. So I'm going to throw them in the S tier with, with Florida. Then we got Toronto Ultra. This looks pretty cool. I think Ultra is just too big, like on the chest. Like it just looks huge. Definitely not my favorite. I think uh, I'm going to put this one in the, the B tier. We'll throw it in B. Yeah, don't take it too personally. I was just giving my honest opinions on the jerseys. And you know, there's always next year to, to design new ones and come up with better ideas. 